I want to tell you about a new project that the University of Vermont Extension and Lake Champlain Sea Grant are launching called the Watershed Explorer Kits. And so this is a set of two kits that are going to be at local libraries. I'm going to tell you how you can check them out um, in a minute. But first I want to show you what's inside the kits. So in our first kit, this kit is meant to be completed at home. And so this is our Watershed Explorer Kit. And in this, the culminating activity is going to be using this tabletop watershed model to evaluate how runoff occurs and how non-point source pollution can impact water quality. So in the kit, there are a couple shakers with some um, kind of some different amalgamations of things. So one is meant to be a fertilizer, one is meant to be road salt. So you're going to sprinkle these on the model and kind of just across the landscape where they might naturally occur. And then you're going to have the opportunity to make it rain. And so while you're doing this, you're going to get to observe how as water moves on the landscape from higher elevations to lower elevations, um, runoff occurs and pollution kind of moves through the landscape. And so that is this activity. And then there are a couple of books and other pieces in here that kind of go along with expanding on that. So this is kit one. And then kit two is meant to be used at a stream or a local water body. And this really is a water quality monitoring backpack with a little kick net here on the side. So this kit is filled with a bunch of goodies that are all geared towards monitoring water quality. So in this backpack, you can monitor chemical parameters such as dissolved oxygen, pH. You can also monitor physical parameters like velocity, flow. And then my favorite part of this is actually using the kick net that is right here. So this piece of equipment kind of unrolls and you can use this with a couple of folks. And this is used for biological assessments. And so when you are in the stream, you're trying to take a snapshot of what's happening. And the biological, the life there, um, these benthic macroinvertebrates that you can kind of see here on this dichotomous key are organisms that are gonna spend either a portion of their life or their entire life cycle living there. And so as a scientist, you know, what does that mean? That means that these are really great indicators of water quality. So depending on the organisms that you're going to find in your sample, it can indicate that it is a body of water that's impaired by pollution or a body of water that's actually quite pristine and healthy. And so these organisms are kind of all mixed up here, but um, depending on kind of what species, like a caddisfly or a mayfly, that's gonna help with your overall evaluation of water quality. And lastly, to tie it all together, so these kits are accompanying our Watershed Explorer Challenge. And so this is a booklet of a series of activities designed to go outside, explore your local watershed, and learn a little bit about the water quality here in the Lake Champlain Basin. This project will be launching on June 17th. There will be a list of all of the libraries that are participating in the Watershed Kit um, program on our website. So you can go there, go to the homepage, and you can kind of follow the links through to see which libraries are participating, where you can pick up kits, um, and also where you can pick up the Watershed Explorer Challenge booklet.